A real asset delivers an actual service like shelter, which is what its actual value is. A nominal asset only has exchange value. It only has value in terms of what we can exchange it for and then derive a service from the thing we exchange it for. But nominal values can have their real equivalence. Suppose that your salary is $100,000 a month. That's its nominal value anyway. And the following year, your salary goes up to $108,000 a month. You've had a nominal increase in your pay. But in the year when your salary is 100,000, a typical basket of groceries costs $20,000. Because of general price increases, the following year, that basket costs $27,000 for the same basket. We can express your salary in each year, not in nominal terms, but in terms of baskets of groceries. So in 2019, your $100,000 salary can buy five baskets. In 2020, after the nominal increase, your salary can buy four baskets. While your nominal salary has gone up, the real equivalent of your salary, your real salary, has gone down. So nominal is value in terms of money and real is value in terms of its intrinsic service or of its equivalent in some other good or bundle of goods.